All right, I'm making this video because I, I'm losing my my fucking mind. Sorry for my language, but I've had countless hours to this troubleshooting. So this is an old older Pix hack, basically a Pix hawk. I originally had some 30 amp Simon K. Um, what do you call it? linear ESCs with some DJI motors? So I and the flight times were just terrible. I think it was too much weight. So I picked up some, got a really good deal on these 360 kV JMTs. And then the I so then I picked up the motors right, and then the iFlight Success 45 amp all in one ESC. I figured I'd use. You know, and it's a BL Heli S D shot 150 to I believe 600. So there's three wires I'm not using. One's current, one's VBAT, and the other one is TX or for telemetry, I believe. So I have all my I configured using Audrey Pilots. You know documentation on how to not use the PWM outputs, and I am using the auxiliary outputs. I switched everything. I did everything by the book, as per Audrey Pilot. So just to show, I cannot connect to the configurator. I've used every single style of application of BL Heli configurator. BL Heli 32 I even tried, older versions. I was able to get in with the BL Heli 32. It was like the 1.6. Everybody was having issues with it. It was the older one. It did work. It read it and stated, you know, it knew that there was four ESCs. It just wouldn't go any further than that. It would just say, it wouldn't say error like it was. It would say, you know, okay, we've read that there's four ESCs cannot connect to ESC number one. So I'm currently I'm connected through Mavlink on telemetry pro protocol to my computer. I am connected, okay? So I just wanna show, this camera keeps going out of focus. Okay, now I've Use, I, I contacted the seller. He said, use the app, uh, Google Chrome app version of it. That's going to fix your problem, okay? So COM5, which is the USB COM, we're going to connect, okay? So it does connect. Let's see. i got to plug in power. Let's see if I can stand up the camera. Plug in the power. Okay, so we got our power connected. The beep's noticing that it is connected to a configurator. Now I'm going to go ahead and hit read setup. Nothing happens. Reading setup finished. And this is all I get. I cannot get anything. I save the debug log, doesn't do anything. There's no options to do anything else. I just don't understand. Hit read setup again. It says the same exact thing. So what I'll do here is disconnect. Okay, so now the reason I did that is Because I can arm look I can arm the, the quadcopter okay I don't know where to put this fucking thing the motor spin let's try it again Motor spin, but they will not go. This is fast they go. We're at full throttle. It's as fast they go. I adjusted endpoints. I didn't really get into the mission planner um, throttle endpoint 
minimum, the th uh, th throttle minimum, uh, arm minimums in that, because they're really, I haven't found any information on what to do, adjust, and I don't want to screw anything up. But this is currently, so that tells you there is a connection. The ESCs are all spinning, the motors, 4 and one ESCs. just I just don't know what to do and this I believe this flight controller sorry the uh, 401 ESC is certainly I believe it's a newer uh, style so if anybody has had a similar issue I know the, the easy fix is going to be I just disconnected the easiest fix is going to be buying another set of ESCs and running them, not, not four in one, just individual ESCs. I understand that. I just would like to figure out how to run these Pixhawk flight controllers on using a four in one ESC with relative ease because I've had failures in the past with the, um, Turnigy, the one everyone else is having issues with that is not even compatible. But I just never was able to successfully get a 4 one ESC to work on any APM or Pixhawk boards. If anybody has any input, I'd really appreciate it. Thank you.